put a basket on putting it on. Time for lamination. This red handbag, I, I like to. I thought it was patent leather, but it's not. And it's unbranded. Here's another bag that's unbranded. I put it back because it has cracks. This is a brand called On Yanny. And the back because it's damaged. Okay, cowboy bag. I'm gonna research that one first before I put it back. Donna Bella. Don't know the brand, I'm not familiar with it, so I'm putting it up. Here we have a Chaps handbag. I would say it's in great shape, but it just don't have a high resale value. And we have a B. Mikowski. It's damaged, so I'm putting that back as well. ink stained I didn't catch earlier. But I really do like this bag. This bag is cowboy gear. I'm putting that back. It is damaged.
Next, I found some Michael Kors slipper shoes. I'm going to try to zoom into the name. The little Michael Kors on the very bottom. Next, I found the brand called Colabora. And it's by Ugg. It's kind of like slightly the low end price point for the Ugg brand. Cola Bora. Now for the accessories, I purchased this Dooney and Burke wristlet. It is missing the little wristlet strap. I was able to purchase another Dooney and Burke. This one is the small drawstring vintage shoulder bag. As you can see, it does have the Dooney and Burke brass charm with a little duck emblem on it. I was able to purchase another Dooney and Burke handbag. This one is an all red pebble leather. It does have a little bit of wear on the corners, so it might just need some polishing to restore some of that finish or the color. And it does have like a luggage charm. You could add a photo in there. In the back, it's embossed. It says Dooney and Burke. I'm not sure if it's shown up on camera. But I just thought that was a cute find. I also purchased a Kate Spade. It's a small crossbody handbag. There's just some minor wear, minor rub wear on the corners. I normally don't purchase the sack handbag, but they do well sometimes. So I just went ahead and grabbed this one up because it was in excellent condition. And I just wanted to just try it to see if it's going to sell for a decent price. If I'm not mistaken, this is the Coach Ergo ERGO handbag. This one's a smaller size. It does have like some scratches on it. But other than the scratches, it's actually okay. That's just like scratches and you can see like an indentation. But, you know, once you're wearing it and with normal wear, it should just, the indentation should actually just bounce right back out. Once the leather kind of like stretches back into shape. I also bought this coach handbag, the signature tote bag. It has like a little dirt mark right here. I'm going to try to clean it possibly just hand wash it to get that dirt off and then if I'm able to get the dirt off then I'll list it. I was extremely pleased to find this large coach handbag. You actually can use it for a laptop bag or a diaper bag, a shopping bag, a beach bag. I can go on and on a carry-all basically. So yeah this was a good find and I'm really excited about this one. I really believe that it should sell high. Now I have some of the most randomest stuff ever and I purchased these just to get the special they had. When you bought three items it was two dollars today. So this wristlet I showed earlier but I actually had to buy three accessories and that, that made it um, two dollars each. So I bought the wristlet, I bought this belt, another belt, I bought these shoe insoles and then another belt and I kind of like this little jewel belt with the um, I'm assuming that's like turquoise I just like the way that was made and it's um it's from Zara you know Zara they sell some expensive stuff so these are just for me except with the exception of the wristlet the belts I'm just going to add to my personal collection and just in case you're wondering who makes the belts, this black one is by Fossil, and this one right here is by Lucky Brand. This one is also by Lucky Brand, and this one is from Zara. So, I'm going to try to show the Fossil label on this one. It's kind of hard to read. Let's see. Yeah, it's going to be really hard to make that out. But it says fossil. And on the buckle itself, this one says lucky brand. 
this one was just really hard to read also. But there you go. So for um, $4 for all those belts, it was truly a steal. Oops, I almost missed this one. So I also bought this coach handbag today in patent leather. It is in excellent condition.